Hi friends, it's me Nikki here to share with you my newly revamped home management system located in my kitchen. I'm so excited to share it with you and also I'm super excited that this video is sponsored by my friends at Avery. I have used their tabs for years and I've shared them with you in my first home management system five years ago along with other videos but now I'm going to share with you how I put together my 2018 command center for our home and that's exactly what a management system is. It needs to be something that labeled properly, something that functions functions properly and your family can go to to get all of that information and things that they need for the running of your household. So I want to take you through mine and show you how I have it set up. So friends, the first notebook I have here is exactly that. It's a notebook and I have it labeled Nikki Gift, Mike Gift, and Bucket List. And what this place is, is where I note all the things that I currently love and that I would love to give, get as a gift. And Mike does the same. I use the Ultra tabs here and I love the Ultra tabs because they're repositionable. So if I need to change things out, I don't have to damage my notebook or anything. They come on and off easily. You know, we write what we want and then when it's our birthday or Valentine's Day, you know, Mike can go here to see what to get me. I can go here to see what get him if we think of things that we want to put on our bucket list we keep it here in a centralized place and again if I want to move it around and use the book notebook for something else later I can easily do it by using the Avery ultra tabs because they pull off so easily and I love that they are so durable they're really durable and friends, I also have a notepad here, message pad. And this is so that if Mike needs to leave me a message or I need to leave him a message, I can jot it down here, put it right there on the counter. He'll see it when he goes to the fridge in the morning. I do the same. And that's the thing about your home management system. You want it to be in a location that family knows this is where you go to for messages. This is where you're going to find your appointments. This is where you're going to find what's going on. And then I have this other little notebook here. And this is where I keep all of our business cards for those things that we use for our home like the lawn service company and the air conditioner service company I keep them all in this little notebook here and what I did was I used the Avery tabs to label each one of them and what I love is that I can print them out on my label machine because friends you all know my handwriting is awful and it sticks for years they don't come off which is great not unless I want to peel it off but it really sticks great to these ultra tabs and so basically here I have the business cards kind of broken down by house service, our doctors, auto, all the different things that we use. I also threw some pins in here so that we have, you know, writing tools when we need it, we can just grab and go. And I put a lot because I know they're going to disappear over the year. And then I have the big baby here. This is the one that's highly used here. And I love this type of system here by using the bound, the disc bound system here, because what's great about this is if it grows and I need to use larger and I need the book to be larger, I just use larger disc and it will grow with my needs. So this is perfect for our family. So you will notice that I use my Avery tabs and I put them towards the top because when you look at our management system, it's easy to see and get to what you need. I then have little cards in the front here to write my recipes on or anything, the instruction cards that I want to write out. I have them here so that I can easily get to them because a lot of times I'm in my kitchen when I'm needing that information. I am going to put a kind of a, a kind of family logo here at the top or name at the, at, at the cover here. I thought that would be fun. And then the first tab is shopping list. This is where I put all of my shopping list and I love that I have this set up now for 2018 it's fresh and clean I have this week's shopping list this month's shopping list six months shopping list because like it's winter time I may need a lawnmower but I don't want to buy it now and I'll put it on the list for six months so that I know in six months to go buy it and so that's the purpose of that and so the subcategories are on the side and then I have the shopping list on the top now the next category here is for cash and Wi-Fi and I love the fact that I can easily get to it. We like to keep cash on hand in case, you know, Girl Scouts come to the door and we want to buy cookies. We have cash on hand or we need just anytime we need to just kind of get to some cash. We have a little bit here and then, you know, it just makes it easy. You know, a lot of times people don't carry cash anymore. So we like to have some where the family can know to come here and you can get some cash. And then also the little cards below are for uh, my Wi-Fi card. So that when guests come over, you know, a lot of times you go to some house and you ask them for their Wi-Fi password and they're like searching up and down for the little card they wrote it on well I have pre-made cards that I can give them and they're good to go and then I have my daily checklist here which I don't really use this a lot actually because I have one in my planner so I do have spares here just in case I need them but I don't grab them from here often so um, I just wanted to tuck them in there 
And then the next section here, this is where I keep stamps and I keep labels with our address labels so that if we need to mail out anything, we have postage stamps and then we also have our mailing labels. Again, the purpose of a home management system is for us to get to those things in one place that we need easily. So in my home management mini binder here, I also like to keep thank you cards because like when I leave a check or money for the lawn service or anything, I can put it in a thank you card. It's just a nice touch when someone comes to help you around your home. And so I like to have them easily on hand so that either Mike or I can grab it and put it in there. And then I have this insert that is empty. I don't have anything in that right now, which I always love to incorporate room for growth when I'm organizing anything. And then the next section is for family birthdays so that I can easily and Mike can easily reference our family birthdays. So it makes it so simple uh, to just go to this section to see that every month whose birthday we have for the month. And then I just have these little list pads here so that I can rip one out unless, in, you know, if I need to do a quick shopping list to take on the go, I have that here along with our keys here. And I put the keys on little just kind of office clamps I find that it's easy to just kind of clamp it off and go use it and then we can easily clamp it back and put it here and so it really just is very simple along with the pool access code we have a neighborhood pool and we keep that in there so that we can easily get to that if we need it so as you can see it's very efficient it has everything that you know we would need to access and it's important that it's labeled so that we can easily get to it and then all family members know how to get to what they need. So friends, the next notebook I have in our management system here is just a simple thin type of notebook that I recently got and I really love it because it's really thin and simple, but it has what I need. You all know I love having a notebook around to brain dump. A lot of times I'm in the kitchen, I have things on my mind that I need to think about later, but I don't want to think about it now. I find that if I write it in my brain dump section of any notebook that I have, I can reference it later and it's out of my mind. I don't have to think about it. The next section is for family meetings. Mike and I like to meet as a family once a week to discuss anything that we have going on. That's the time to share things that are going on, the time to discuss what you want to have for the upcoming meals for the week. If there's any issues, you know, like Mike, please pick up your socks every week or whatever that's the time to discuss it and we like to have an agenda to keep it productive and so this is where we would write out our agenda and then the other section unknown is just for random just kind of thoughts and the next book here is a calendar and this is a 2018 calendar that I just got so that we could write down our appointments service dates for the house you know all those types of things and we can reference it and I have this Avery Ultra tab here in red and that's what I love about Avery is they have all the different colors which are great because we can flag appointments so like if Mike has a doctor's appointment I'll put it on the red here so that when he comes to the kitchen in the morning it will be a reminder a visual reminder we use the Avery tabs all throughout my office at the at home with Nikki offices I I love them it, it's how we know what to do when and what status all of our projects are in and the great thing about them is like I said you can write on both the front and back and they're smudge free so they're really efficient you don't have to use a label maker to print them I love them the other thing is I'm going to tag it right here to say family binder or something like that I have not done that yet again this system is kind of revamped so I haven't done all the little tweaks to it but in our final kind of here we have a binder that I have all of my meal planning printables in and this is my meal planning sheet that you can get off my website at homewithnikki.com and I just have that in there along with our emergency preparedness um, kind of forms here or, or better yet printables here and that's where we can keep things in case we have a hurricane or anything like that which we do have here in South Carolina and it has all of our emergency contacts in it uh, family member contact names and numbers that we can easily get to our home inventory list insurance contact list it's great to have the emergency um, kit checklist all those things um, in one place and then finally in this binder is our mail sorting system. So when the mail, whoever picks up the mail, they come exactly to the kitchen is kind of the hub of our home and where we come to. So we go through the mail, we automatically trash any junk mail, anything that needs to be filed for us, we put in there. Anything that either of us, either of us would like to read, we put in here. And that way we can read it within the week. If not, it gets trashed. And then in the last one is for shred, which we don't like to put things in here ideally and I don't like mail on the counter but if we need can't get right to the shredder so this is also tabbed off so we can easily see what we need and it really is helpful so key having everything so that you can easily see it and grab to it and great what's great about the Avery tabs is that I can change it around because they're repositionable I can change things around if I need it easily and I don't destroy the tabs 
And friends, I also want to say we're coming up on tax time. And so you're pulling out those tax binders. I keep every tax year in a tax binder. And I use the tabs to kind of keep things in order throughout that tax binder. You know, there's so many different forms and all kinds of things. And these are so durable. And these are great for kids, like when they're school things, because there's the tabs, they you can't destroy them. They, you know, they can flip and flop in their, their backpacks and they will last. And these new ones here by Avery are so fun. They come in different colors. And what I loved about this one is you all know I have my spring cleaning box that I use I have you know for our spring cleaning project this is a fun way a fun family friendly way to get your house spring cleaned I did a free previous video on this years ago and what I loved about the new Avery tabs is it allowed me to give a variation in color because I have the Avery blue but I needed to have subcategories you know to kind of have the main categories like downstairs upstairs and different areas and so I can use the decorative tabs to kind of identify those and then keep the simple blue ones for my tabs so I am going to do thanks to Avery a giveaway for some of these tabs so that you can put your home management system together and look they're smudge free so you're really gonna love them you don't have to print them out on label makers which keeps it simple and friends I have an additional tip for you so friends now we're up in my craft room my woman's cave this is also my office and this is where we keep our home file cabinet and I encourage every family every home to have some type of system to keep your files in order if you're just starting out this may be a simple folder or a simple box it doesn't have to be anything you know fancy you know Mike and I we have been together a long time and have established a lot of things and so we have to keep certain things on file and I have found for us that having a binder system is the best way to keep our files in order I love it because if we have to handle business, we can easily take the files with us. Um, it just works for us. I adopted this from working at a school in the UK. They had a binder system for our files there and I absolutely loved it. So it works out great for us because I can just easily open the drawers, see all of our different categories, grab what I need, and everything is just organized very efficiently. So friends, to give you a little look into one of my binders to kind of show you the setup, this is our wheels binder. And this is where we keep all the wheels for our family, for Mike and I, and I try to keep it for my parents as updated as possible. And I encourage you to keep, you know, the wheels that you're gonna have to address um, when that time comes on hand so that you don't have to look for those things. And so everyone has their little pocket sleeve here with their specific wheel included in there. And I have a little cover sheet over here so that, you know, just for confidentiality there. But basically I just have the little repositional tab on there so we know what wheel belongs to whom if I need to change things around as we go through life I can easily do that um, with the repositionable Avery tab so it really is very convenient and so again everyone is kind of identified and it's very simple to where I can just open the binder look at it um, and I keep these little tabs here so that if I need to take action like you know it's the beginning of the year we're looking at all of our files to kind of keep them updated and so my dad told me recently that he needed to give me his updated will because he did make some changes and so that tells me I need to take action to make sure that I get that so I'll put a little red tab onto the binder so that when I open and kind of open the cabinet I can see the red tab and it tells me this is what I need to follow up on so these tabs are really helpful because again I will forget to follow up but when I open the drawer I can clearly see I have an action that I need to take so these tabs are perfect and then I want to take it into my kitchen into my baking cabinet here many of you have saw this and I have my little recipe book here I am not one that likes cookbooks um, to kind of collect them. I feel like it takes a valuable real estate in my home. We all use the internet to get our recipes, but I do like having that little book or little kind of binder that has those go-to recipes, those recipes that I use all the time, the ones that I use for the holidays, you know, the ones that are kind of sacred to me. And so this is what this book is is and it's a little planner here and I just have my Avery tabs on here and they work great in allowing me to keep my recipes all together. I love that it's compact so if I want to take it to the grocery store or want to take it out of town if I'm going to cook at another guest house or something like that I have it you know easily right here at my fingertips. You all know I always love to laminate my recipe cards and I love this because when you're cooking if you spill batter or anything on the card you can easily wipe it off it just helps protect them and again these are recipes that are my tried and true the ones that I you know I hold dear to me and so I love having them in this compact little binder here and I can easily see what category I have with the label so that helps me when I'm trying to get to a recipe but I love that this is easy to keep in the cabinet and it really just does not take up a lot of space in my home so friends I'll put the Avery link below definitely check it out along with the link to the giveaway I hope you all will enter have a beautiful day my friends I will see you at the next video and this is Nikki saying goodbye